So uh, abortion's a big deal. All these passages that we have in the Bible, Old Testament, New Testament, God hates abortion. I close my Bible. What proves to me that God hates abortion if I don't have the Bible? And I thought, you know, you know there is nothing anywhere in the natural world that kills his young while it's still in the womb. There's no, I don't care if you believe in evolution. You don't believe in God? Great. Even in the evolutionary process, there's nothing that kills the young while it's still in the womb. That's a violation of even evolutionary no, process. No, it gives its life to protect it. It gives its life yeah. to protect it. It, does, it yeah. does not take life. I do not need the Bible to tell me abortion is wrong. How about homosexuality? Same thing. That's not part of nature. It does occur in nature, but it's always an aberration. It is not normal in nature. There's no species that practices homosexuality because you won't be a species if you do. I mean, it's, real, it's not, it's against, I don't care if you believe in evolution. It's against evolutionary law. It doesn't happen. So why are we doing it over here? You know, it's not in his revealed word. It's not in his created message. So, but we get into this thing of, oh, well, you know, we need to be compassionate. Well, great, be compassionate. God's love is every person. That doesn't mean I tolerate the behavior. Now, I'm going to be compassionate towards someone who commits murder, but that doesn't mean I approve the behavior.